everyone. This is your girl Nicole Tyler. Be sure to unsubscribe from my channel. Do not hit the notification bell and definitely do not like and share my videos. Now this video is sponsored by Regina's Hair Salon out of Houston, Texas. For more information, description link is down below. Let's get into it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why are you down here in this sector of YouTube trolling Tasha K? Oh, because she does have high numbers. She has many subscribers. They're called the winos. And that this black woman is very successful at what she does is putting out information. And she's doing a great job at it. Whether you feel that she has integrity, whether you feel that she is credible, whether you feel that what she's putting out is false, a lot of people like her form of entertainment. And she's great at it. Now... You thought that when you was trolling Tasha K and you did your little video on Tasha K, that Tasha K was not going to come back at you? <laughs> Welcome to this sector of YouTube. No, See, no, you know, no. I don't like it. I don't like it. See, I see... I see things the way they are. Some people are going to be like, oh, it's Perez Hilton. He's been in the game for so long. We have to respect him. No, we don't. He got blood and flesh and flesh and blood just like we got. You don't need to brag to us down here on this sector. Like I told you, we the bomb down here. We are our own Madonna and Britney Spears down here. We running this down here. And here you come down here trying to eat off us. Hell to the no, nah, no nah, to the hell. I'm rocking with the winos. I'm rocking with Tasha K. Some of us on this sector is just, is just so shallow. Y'all have no loyalty to your own damn selves. Y'all sell out to everybody. Y'all don't have no loyalty to anybody that even look like you. <laughs> I'm not surprised. I ain't even gonna go no further because y'all know I can talk too much and then people will come over here. You just learned how we get down in this sector, Perez Hilton. If you do a video with Tasha name in the title and you put her in your commentary, you better bet. She is going to make a video about you, okay? Whether it's false commentary, whether it's derogatory, whether it's coming for your juggler, you have to be ready, honey. Yes, and that green beard that you got, it needs to be red, white, blue, yellow, purple, and green when you come down here in this sector. In this sector, we're going we gonna to toughen you up in this sector, okay? So if you plan on doing any commentary, on the likes of Tasha K, man up, okay? So that's the best thing I can tell you, but it seems like to me that you're trying to eat off Tasha K. Tasha K has worked very hard to get to where she is. Being here in this sector of YouTube is no joke. Perez Hilton had the nerve and the audacity to call Tasha K toxic for YouTube. Don't worry what we got down here in this sector of YouTube. It's a damn shame you got many people in this sector going against Tasha K, our queen. Then they really want to be like you have a nerve to be subjective and dogging her out at the same time. How does that damn it work? Can we at least show some loyalty? Can we at least band together for that? No. See, Perez, if you make a video calling somebody toxic, then you have to wait for the response. And the response may be cruel. The response may be that you're a pedophile. The response may be that you're stinking, that you're ugly, and that you're in the tub with your child naked. Now, you say you watch Tasha K, so you know how low she go. But you didn't care because you were, some, you were, doing, you were playing a little chess, but you, you lost at this game. Tasha K is a beast at this game. She is the G-O-A-T, the GOAT, greatest of all time at this game. Then you're going to hop your tail over there to Amon Wiggins? Mm-mm, no. Psh, child, you lost already. Lost ones. That's what you, both y'all are the lost ones over there. Then Perez Hilton had the nerve to take his ass over there to the Amon Wiggins show. Talking about some, yes, she's doing a great job. Yes, she has a lot of subscribers. After he did admit that he was cloud chasing off her name. But he's going to say all of her work is BS. And that he's critical of everybody. So I love the part when Amon asked him, said, well, there's people are saying that you're racist. And that you don't have anybody on your podcast. And then he's going to, you know, try to throw in that little 
Please, please, please let me on your podcast because I'm trying to make it up there with Tasha K and Lovely T. Laugh. That's the kind of laugh he did. He threw in there. And, and you know what Perez Hilton said? Perez Hilton said, well, I just like hearing myself talk. So that's why I don't have any guests. Mm -hmm. I bet you if Britney Spears or Madonna or any one of those other women that he bragged about wanted to be on his podcast, oh, he would do anything to have them. Armand Wiggins, who are you? You are nobody to Perez Hilton. Let's get it right. He is clout chasing off of you and mainly Tasha K. Don't you see that, dummy? No, you're, <laughs> I'm going to make it big. <laughs> like, come on. What is for you is for you. You'll make it if it's for you. But don't try to knock our queen Tasha K down. She did that on her own. Whether she has a team, she said, whether she's doing exclusives, whether she has a team that gives her all that information. People like the way Tasha K puts it out. So why are y'all hating on Tasha K? It, it's just a shame we have no camaraderie in this sector. Child, what I saw in that damn video was Amon Wiggins kissing Perez Hilton's ass. Perez Hilton, why are you down here with the likes of us? Amon Wiggins, for some reason, he thinks that he is not in this sector because he has, what, 55,000 subscribers, which is nothing compared to people who has Lovely T, Tasha K, even Perez Hilton, and other, other members that has a million subscribers. He thinks that he's up there with them. He's up there groveling. Please let me on your podcast. Please let me on your podcast. When Perez Hilton is sitting up there using you to get to Tasha K so that he can clout chase and get some of Tasha K subscribers. Like, Amon Wiggins, you, ooh, you, you didn't hit an all-time low for me, dog. You, you get 10 thumbs down. And being, and being a damn culture vulture in our sector. Stop trying to, to come down here and get all of us to make videos because really my video is about bigging up my big sis. No, my little sis, Tasha K. Chad, I can't stand a person to pick up a rock. Mm-hmm, throws it. Then the person who they threw the rock at picks the rock up and throws it right back at them, which meant much more strength and power. Mm-hmm. And you know what that person does? They start crying and whining, playing the victim. You know what my you know what my advice is? Don't pick up the rock at all if you can't handle the speed. <laughs> if you can't handle the hurt. If you can't handle the pain. Okay.